Hello and welcome to This Week in Longmont for October 16, 2020. I'm your host, Sergio Angeles. Let's get started. A boost for Longmont businesses. The city of Longmont is launching the Boost Longmont Business Grant to encourage the recovery, resilience, and long-term viability of local small businesses and nonprofits that contribute to a strong local economy. Grant funding is provided through the Federal CARES Act Coronavirus Relief Fund and is administered by the city. Grants will provide working capital assistance, assistance for businesses and nonprofits in amounts of up to 15,000 each, and there is a total of 1.1 million available. Eligible businesses and nonprofits can apply beginning October 20th. Visit lamontcoloradogovernor forward slash boost business grant for details. Drop off old medicines for free. Drugs discarded down the drain can pass through the wastewater treatment plant and into St. Vrain Creek. Instead of throwing them away, residents can take them to a free drop-off event from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Saturday, October 24, in the circular drive in front of the Longmont United Hospital. Do not park your vehicle or enter the hospital or lobby, and please wear a mask when you enter the drive. Pills, capsules, liquids, inhalers, patches, over-the-counter medicines, etc. are welcomed. No needles, thermometers, controlled substances, medical equipment, personal care products, household hazardous waste, or business waste accepted. For more, informa for more information, please call 303-651-8416. Author Talk, Stranger Than Fiction. Amid COVID-19, climate change, civil unrest, historic political polarization, and a highly contentious U.S. presidential race, Truth is stranger than fiction is a phrase we've all become a little too familiar with. Join three accomplished novelists as they reflect on how the present moment far outstrips even their wild, wildest imaginings. This program will be live streamed on the museum's Facebook page, on lamontpublicmedia.org, and on local Comcast Channel 8 or 880 at 7.30 p.m. on Thursday, October 22nd. You can visit lamontcolorado.gov forward slash museum to learn more and see other upcoming virtual programs. Help make Longmont more sustainable. Would you like to contribute to Longmont sustainability and community resilience? The city of Longmont is offering volunteer opportunities to become SOLL sustainability ambassadors to provide education and perform cost saving eco upgrades for Longmont residents. Applicants must be 18 or older and live in Longmont. Training in health safety Training and health and safety wear will be provided. For more details, please visit bit.ly forward slash Longmont S-O-L-L. Volunteer for police review panel. The city manager of the city of Longmont is accepting applications for five volunteer positions on the Longmont Police Department Professional Standards Review Panel. This group reviews highly confidential information including internal investigations and allegations of misconduct, and makes findings to the chief of police. Panel members must be able to read and comprehend large investigations and must be registered to vote in the city of Longmont. Applicants with misdemeanor convictions in the past five years or any felony conviction will not be considered. Current employees of any law enforcement agency as well as immediate family members of Longmont Police Department employees are not eligible. Please visit bit.ly forward slash Longmont PSU or call 303-651-8694 for an, for an application and for more information. The application deadline is 5 p.m. on Friday, October 23rd. Don't trash your leaves. Compost. After you finish playing in the leaves, bag them up for collection instead of putting them in the trash can. Curbside leaf collection begins November 2nd and collective leaves are composted. Please visit bit.ly forward slash longmont-leaf or call 303-651-8416 to find your pickup date. Maintain your trees and shrubs. Public sidewalks, streets, and alleys must be kept clear of low-hanging tree branches and overgrown vegetation that impede pedestrians or vehicles. There must be a minimum of 8 feet of vertical clearance over sidewalks and 15 feet of clearance over streets and alleys. Shrubs and other vegetation must be maintained so that the entire width of the sidewalk is clear and vegetation in alleys should provide adequate access for waste collection vehicles. 
please use a locally licensed tree contractor to remove larger tree limbs. You can take tree limbs and other yard waste to the Waste Division Center at 140 Martin Street at no cost. Also take a picture ID and a recent City of Lama utility bill to show residency. You can call 303-651-8416 with questions. And that's it for this week in Longmont. I'm Sergio Angeles. Thank you for watching and have a good weekend.